What they think of the coffee service? It's nice. Mm. Very Makes a change. Good. From Very good. The usual sort of bit of Mitchell's coffee. Civilized. Yeah. Thank it you. Is, so I think a civilized is. Oh, really? How was the gig? It was great. Because you're playing with the Saints at the moment, aren't you, mm. too? Yeah, with Selena's and, and um, it was about two o'clock by the time you came off stage and then by the time you sort of unwind and get home. Yeah. So this is very civilised. And you've got a hell of a long way to drive to Barrel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not supposed to mention, that was a, I put in a substitute suburb. Annandale, isn't it? Isn't Shut up. Like that? <laughs> um, we're, actually, we're about to play the, the new video very shortly and it's a really great clip. It's a what? A very great clip. It's I a really... very great clip. Yeah, it's no, a great clip. Don't worry about my English. It's a no, historical sense right of the word. Mm. Right. He's a little bit we nervous. Just, you know, and it, you just got it satellited over. That's right. We, uh, we stole it. Actually, the record company don't even know about charge. this. And boy, are they going to be spitting chips on Monday when they get into work. Well, they'll probably be Monday afternoon by the time they get into work. Anyway, um, the album, may we just say congratulations. It sounds great. Thank you. And, uh, and I guess I should really talk about lifestyle because I'm interested in what the stars do when they're away from the stage. I mean, I have a, a whisper that you're into skin diving. Scuba diving. Scuba, scuba diving? Yeah. Is there a difference between skin and scuba? Oh, I don't know. I just kind of, it's like calling it, it flippers and fins, you know? Goggles and schnorkels. Yes, all that kind of thing. Did, how long have you been doing it for? Um, since 84. You got your ticket and all that kind mm -hmm. of stuff? And why do you do it? Is it... I think it's, it's, it's just good. I mean, the rock and roll lifestyle and all that, it's good to... Sort of get back to nature and I go wreck diving actually when I'm a wreck I think. <laughs> yeah. Go down there and go wreck diving up to the Solomon Islands where all the, the wrecks are from the Second World War. Mm. And uh, Have you had much chance for that lately though? Um because you've both been pretty busy. Sometimes, you? not not heaps. Not heaps. No, it's like a whole excursion in itself. Mm. So you record you remixed and recorded the album in uh, New York? In Los Angeles. In LA. Mm. And and how was that? Because, I mean, you've worked Great over time. there a couple of times, haven't you? Mm. Yeah, we recorded our first album, Desperate, in, yeah. um, in New York. And um, this one we decided to do in Los Angeles. Probably mainly because Mike Chapman, our producer, lives mm. there and he, he didn't want to go further than five miles away from his front <laughs> gate. We recorded this great studio called um, Sunset Sound, where Prince has done a lot of work there and the mm. Stones. and It's like this sort of really funky studio. Yeah. Have, have, have you guys changed since the since the desperate days? I mean, you know, I mean, I know the band's changed. <laughs> I'm not allowed to make jokes like that. And see, it's better when you guys do it because they say, "I wish John would take it a bit more seriously," but I didn't do the change clothing joke. Right? Yes, we have changed. You've changed your image yeah. too a little bit, haven't you? Oh yeah, like the school uniform bit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I... Mark's wearing that now. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. Here it is, the the rock and roll school knocks. uniform. Can, you, can, can we talk about, very briefly, there was a few problems. I thought you were working with uh, a producer in England, the guy who did Art of Noise and all that sort of stuff. Oh, he did the, he did the um, One Life album. Was mm. there, I mean, there was a few rumours going around the industry that there was like a bit of a non compass vibe that he didn't really get on that well, or a few arguments. No? no nothing as interesting as that. No. We did the album and um, everything was fine. And... Um, and then we we weren't really happy with the the content, so we mm. recorded some more songs. But mm. no, it was fun. He was, he was great to work with. You... He was good. Gary was great. Yeah. To work with. But are you uh, very cautious about your own sound? I mean, you, you it must be a big thing after you've done a whole album. Suddenly go, no, we don't like it. We'll go back and do it again. Is that a hard decision to make? Yeah, I th I think um, it's not a case of we didn't like the whole album. We just wanted to. You know, by the time. By the time it all happens, there's so many things too, like when you're signed to an American company and stuff, it mm. takes a long time to get things, you know, going, yeah. like to send it over and to get it back. Do they, do they have much say, like, because I know that the James Rain clip has just been remade, uh, Fall of Rome, because the American company didn't like him, what he was wearing, they wanted him in a sort of jeans and a t-shirt. Uh, do you get people like saying, hey, love this stuff, it's fantastic, but listen, uh, Christina, could you maybe wear something? <laughs> yeah. Can we get back to that schoolgirl thing? I mean, do you, do you find that they sort of dictate to you a lot? Um, they haven't so far. It's just if they don't like it, they won't get behind it. Right. Yeah. You know. So, so it's, it's like it. you know, right. if we don't like it, we won't we won't get behind it. So that's the, that's the thing. That's what happens. And if Mark doesn't like it, he'll just go and play in the, one of his model planes. Or yeah. is that true that you're actually into sort of ooh, those? Are they radio control no, ones? No, not or real, those ones. Real ones. Not those ones. No. He's got a he's got real ones too. Yeah, sort of. Uh, I like them. I build them. I fly them, I crash mm. them, I burn them. You know. <laughs> Good, remind me not to go flying with you at any stage, That's cool. Mark. All right, uh, we're going to show... Just the models. Just the models. <laughs> just the models. <laughs> they are great bands, too. But the real, but the real ones, too. Yeah. Oh, not the models. Um, 
Now, we're going to show um, Hey Little Boy. Which was originally Hey Little, Little Girl, Girl, wasn't it? Right. But for now, obvious what was reasons. the band that originally put that out? Sound Syndicate. Yeah. Sounds, whatever happened to Sound Syndicate? Mm -hmm. It's like They're a one-off buzz, one of 60. They're raking in the royalties as soon as this song becomes a big hit. Just yep. as I, I heard the song in, in uh, when <clears throat> we were in LA and I really liked it. Mm. And, uh, I didn't. <laughs> you didn't. She didn't want to do it, actually. What do you think about it now? I love it. Yeah? Because it's the clip's great. It's kind of good great. when that happens, yeah. Yeah, it was good. I mean, I didn't like it for a little short while. Mm. That was all. And After then she I came heard back. it, she liked it. That's yeah. like that, isn't um, it? Dano and I like that one. We, we, we say, we like, we like it, we hear it. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. But, uh, you're going to be playing around with the Saints for, for quite a while? or No, we're just doing, we just did last night and tonight at Selena's. Mm. Yeah. And then you're going to be on the road around the country? Um, we might be doing a few more dates before we go overseas. Oh, right. All right, well, listen, you're welcome back to Saturday Morning Live anytime. And thanks Thank for you very much. On. Stick around, enjoy the coffee. Let's have a look at Hey Little Boy. Yeah.